So this is the uh, Dharamsala Skyway. Basically a skyway. Oh god, this is so scary. This <laughs> fast. This so this skyway opened at the beginning of this year, so it's really close to brand new, which is kind of I feel like awesome because new technology, but also once things have been around for a while, I feel like they've like broken in. You know they're gonna work perfectly. Worked out the kinks. Yeah, worked yeah. out the kinks. So this is the skyway. Check it out. Hope you guys enjoy the view. Unbelievable We're view out this window. Just test subjects right now. Yeah. No, Ryan seems to be enjoying it. Just What's hanging going out, on, loving buddy? it. We're so, still over here, back here, that's the, uh, that's Mekliyod Ganj here in Dharamshala. So, that's a whole entire village, Tibetan village, mainly lots of Buddhist monks. Because, if you've seen our other video, if not, it'll be up here. But this is the home of the Dalai Lama. So, over here in this compound behind Brianna is where the Dalai Lama lives. He's, yeah, another vantage point. Yeah, absolutely. I've never seen it from this. We've walked down that path before, but we've never seen it from this angle. And he's been living here ever since they came here, escaping as refugees from China. And this is their oh complex. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was crazy. Wow, look at that. Like yeah. You can see all the little... Unbelievable. The so many. The oh, windows are a bit so tinted, but it's absolutely incredibly beautiful. Wow, I very last night and the clouds parted. Yeah, it took us four whole days to get the clouds to part this way. But it's incredible. What a sunset. And this is one of the last, pretty much the last uh, ride of the night. Yeah, because this is the very last one, yeah. They said it closes at 5.30, it's probably 5. 10 right now, so the moment we get down there, we're just gonna oh take God. it on back up. Look at this drop that we're gonna do. Right oh, here. wow, yeah, it's about to get pretty steep. Check <laughs> this out. <laughs> Amazing. Wow. Here we go. Oh my gosh. It's like a roller coaster. It's a it little is. Roller coaster. It's almost, oh, it's, it's pretty scary going over the yeah. tracks because it moves a bit, but it's almost, to me at least, because I'm not super good with the heights. It's almost scarier than a roller coaster because of how slow it goes. Because your senses aren't all bunched up in the experience. You can like relax, your brain is thinking, you're realizing how high you are off the ground. <laughs> wow, look at that. Unbelievable. Hi. Look at that, bud. <laughs> Say hi. hi. His first cool. Skyway. <laughs> this is incredible. Good. Wow, now it does get steep here. Thanks. Look at that. Amazing. Look how cool. Oh, cool. oh my gosh. That's a little bumpy. No, it's, no, it's kind of steep. Does this no. scare you at all? No, Heights? No, no. Not at all, you're good. I want to go skydiving. I'm the only one. Yeah, she wants to go skydiving. <laughs> right now I'm at a point where I'm, I'm not ready to do that. <laughs> Skydiving has always been one of the scariest things ever to me. I don't know if any of you guys have skydived, but I'd love to know what you think about it below. That'd be awesome. I don't know if you guys can see this out here, but so Dharamsala is up in the mountains here in Himachal Pradesh, and then the mountains flatten out right down here, and there's this big, pretty lake way over in the distance. And if you keep going way farther that direction, like 100 to 150 kilometers, you get to uh, Amritsar, which is where one of the golden temples is, a really beautiful spiritual city, which is also then close to the border of Pakistan and the Wagyu border. So it's pretty cool, the Wagga border. So a lot of cool stuff all over the place. Wow, what a sunset. We really picked the perfect day to do this. Yeah. Unbelievable. <laughs> It's like, what is that? Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh, it's open. Yeah. Okay. That's kind of scarier. Why? <laughs> it's like perforated metal here. Uh -huh. So you're getting all the air oh. from the outside. You can like feel it move. It's an emergency. I assume that's it in case you get stuck. Look at this little compound over here. Wow. A little homestay or something. Oh, look at Amazing. this. They're coming up over the city. So this is like the heart of Dharamshala. Where we stay up there is McLeod Ganj. This is Dharamshala proper. Wow. Oh so beautiful though. Hi, buddy. 
Hi. He wants to hold the GoPro. <laughs> say hi. Oh, oh, say hello. Oh, okay. Ryan's first person view. <laughs> <laughs> he laughs. So funny. Amazing buildings too. Look at that. There's nothing, you know, mountain towns are always so beautiful no matter where you are. But the ones here in India especially are super colorful. And you can see from the Tibetan influence, I don't know if you guys can see way over there, but there's tons of prayer flags all over the place. Mm. Wow. Wow, that's so cool. <laughs> that is amazing. We're leaving Dharamshala tomorrow morning and heading uh, back over towards Uttarakhand, um, which is a bit farther east, closer to Nepal. Um, where Rishikesh and lots of other spiritual cities are, Heart of the War, places like that. So this is our last night and it's been super cloudy and overcast so we picked a really good, lucky, great, beautiful time to come and do this ride. Good, good send off. Wow, look at that. Wow, where are we? <laughs> is that amazing? <gasps> is that look incredible? That. Coming in on the end of it. Getting down to the base where the majority of Dharamshala is, the town. Check that out. Wow. <laughs> you can see a ton of other smaller mountain ranges way over there in the distance. There's the center that we're going into where we turn around and come back up. <laughs> Is that funny? <laughs> ah. That is crazy. I think so for sure. There's not many skyways either. I can't even remember, you know. The last time I was on a skyway was like five, six years ago. It's been a long time. They're not super common. This is a really cool one. Beautiful. All right, here we go. Making our way into the center. We can turn around and head back up. straight back up we're not getting off because otherwise we'd be stuck down here and it's like this is a 10 minute skyway journey but if you get a cab it's like 20 to 30 minutes on a pretty harrowing road so i'm just gonna let them know we're just going back up Like that, we're gonna head on back up. <laughs> you is so beautiful. It really is. Got some cool pictures. Hey. Okay. Ryan's ready for his evening nap. <laughs> Transitions. <laughs> so many tracks, it just bounces, bounces, bounces for like three seconds when it goes over them. It's scary. I'm not a fan of it. You guys should definitely check this out if you come to Dom Shaw. It's worth it. I'm glad we did it. We almost didn't, but super happy we did. It's fun to see all the different layers of the, of the city here. Right? Didn't, I didn't even know any of these were down here compared to where we are way up there. Just little neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. I think this is, we have more like family homes, neighborhoods, people living here. Yeah. Really awesome little pockets of society. Wow. Now Narayan's starting to really <laughs> notice where he is. <laughs> hey, he's loving it now. He is. 
So we're headed back into McLeod Gons now. All the way from the bottom down there. So cool. The round trip only took like 25 minutes. Look at you, buddy. <laughs> He's loving that. Like, wow. Boom, 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 boom. He's like, how am I up here? This is incredible. <laughs> So again, there's the Dalai Lama's compound one last time. So you get a really cool, unique vantage of it. And now we're coming back in. This little building right here houses the whole project. There's a big old parking garage. That's a huge parking garage. <laughs> He's loving it. He's cracking up. All right, guys. Well, I think we're going to end the video here. As we're heading back in, we're going to make our way back home, get some rest before we head off in our taxi tomorrow. Thank you for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the video. And we'll see you guys later. See you later.